Today, we're going to learn how to quickly and easily shorten, customize, and share any links you want as branded links, all with the Rebrandly Chrome extension. Hi everyone, I'm Sean Connolly here for Rebrandly, and today I'm going to show you just how handy the Rebrandly extension is for shortening and rebranding your links on the fly. So to do this, you're going to need a Rebrandly account. No worries if you don't have one, it's super simple to set up and can be done in a matter of minutes. Once you've done that, from the dashboard, we'll click on the Apps tab. As you can see here, we've a nice selection of integrations to choose from. If Chrome isn't your thing, no worries at all. We also have a Firefox extension, as well as a bookmarklet for nearly all other browsers. So you're all covered. But today, we're focusing on the Chrome extension. Once we click that, we are given the option Add to Chrome. As you can see, I've already done so. It would have been a little bit embarrassing if I hadn't. Once you've this done and the extension is installed on your browser, you will see the little Rebrandly icon in the top right hand corner. Now all we have to do is test it out. Let's use the Rebrandly YouTube page. While we're here on the page, I just click the icon and voila, our link has been automatically shortened and branded. However, I want to customize the link before I share it, so let's go ahead and do that. Here I can choose the domain I want to use. I have a few options here, so let's see. Let's use rebrandly.video, and we'll call this one Rebrandly on YouTube. Now remember, links are not case sensitive, so feel free to use caps where you like. I like these because it looks neat. Our link is ready to go. So from here, we can copy to our clipboard, share to any social media, create a QR code as well, and if you have a change of heart, you can delete the link straight away too. So, to recap, open your Brandly dashboard, click on the Apps tab, select the Chrome extension. Once installed, ensure the icon is at the top of your browser. On any web page, select the Brandly extension icon. In the pop-up, choose what domain and slash tag you want for your branded link. Copy to clipboard, and that's it. Thanks for watching this tutorial everyone, if you found it helpful do be sure to let us know in the comments below and if so why not give us a like and a subscribe as well, it would be greatly appreciated, thank you very much. You can watch more helpful tips by clicking the videos on screen or in the description as well and until next time, take care.